Hello everyone, welcome to a brand new blind LP. Now I've got a couple of um, playlists that I'm going to start adjusting, uh, start, well, start creating on the channel and they're going to be the PS1 classic, blind, blind um, LPs, but all the games are going to be one overall playlist. Now this game I did play many years ago but I've never touched it since. Okay, so like I said, I've not played this game for many years, I've never actually completed it before. But, it's certainly a game that is rich with uh, this quite vibrant sort of art style that's rather um, unusual. Uh, it's got sort of like colours mixed with black and white. I'm going to go for casual because I don't want to um, have a, you know, a bitch run, <laughs> if you like. and see what this is like, shall we? By EA? Oh, excuse me. Set in um, occupied France during World War Two. Is this seat taken? I'm not looking for company. You're in Paris, my friend. In this city, no one drinks alone. So, what are we celebrating? <laughs> we aren't. But if you're keen to get your teeth kicked in, I'll be happy to oblige. Mm, I'd have thought you were too busy kicking yourself. With good reason, I'm sure. What's it to you? You think you're the only man in Paris hoping to drown a guilty conscience? This city is filled with men like us. We all have good reasons. I've been watching you these past weeks. I have seen that you have no love for the Nazis. The question is, how many more people will die at the hands of these jackbooted killers while you sit there cowering like a whipped dog? You're mad enough to break that bottle over my head, but you won't lift a finger to help these people, eh? This isn't my country. Oh, did you abandon your conscience at the border? Does the need for justice end at some land drawn on a map? Aye, if it's a map of Ireland. You Frenchmen have unrealistic expectations. Open your eyes! The war is all around us! You can't escape it! You can hide here and leave the fighting to braver men. Or you can walk out that door and do what must be done. The choice is yours! Keep it down. That sort of talk will get us both a bullet in the back of the head. I intend to do more than talk. There is a courtyard around the corner. 
Meet me there when you are ready to stop hiding. So I'm playing as, I forgot you play as uh, a guy who's Irish in this game. But the, I remember this, and obviously it's about the French re the uh, Revolution in France, the French Revolution. I mean, the game looks amazing. There's a very good, nice art song in this game. This is an open world game. I remember playing this game where you blow up a tower of some kind. I remember doing that. Ah, I see you're a man who'd rather die on his feet than live on his knees. I'd rather the Krauts did the dying. Excellent. There is a German fuel depot down the street. 5,000 barrels of precious petrol, guarded by a handful of half-drunk supply clerks. Sounds like one hell of a fire hazard. My thoughts exactly. We'll need something to get the fireworks started. I know a place where we can get what we need. But first, I must know. Are you prepared to kill if necessary? The way I see it, these Nazi bastards bought their own tickets to hell. I'm just laying out the welcome mat. That's my car there. I'll drive. <laughs> How beautiful this, this game looks. It's black and white, but we're... Let's get moving. Where are we headed? I spotted a German supply cache nearby. I am sure they won't mind if we borrow a few things. Huh? Have you ever handled explosives before? I handled a bombshell once. Turned out she was married. This is serious. All right, keep your knickers on. I know what I'm doing. I had a feeling you would. Mad, look at this. Fucking Nazis everywhere. Infesting my beautiful city like cockroaches. They certainly made themselves at home. It's time to show them a different kind of hospitality. Caches down that alley. Let's go. Look at those spineless jackals. I can't stand it anymore. Whoa, steady, mate. Let's just get what we came for. Espèce d'enfant du mer! Christ, here we go. What the fuck was all that about? Uh, not now. Let's go. Oh, sorry, love. The crates are up there, but we need to be careful. This supply cache is a restricted area. Oh, why? Was that you being careful back in the alley? I lost my temper. It won't happen again. See that it doesn't. I didn't leave a nice warm bar just to get my head blown off. If we are spotted near the crate, the Germans will attempt to sound the alarm. Then we'll have to get rid of that lookout first. Yes, you should be able to find hand and footholds on the surface of that building. Climb up there and throw that Nazi piece of shit from the roof while I move in on the ground. Can you do that? It's a piece of piss. I do not know this phrase. It means yes. Ha! <laughs> I do not know this phrase. Okay, this reminds me of um of Assassin's Creed. Hey! Damn, Blyman! Ah! 
Tell me, Irishman! We cannot allow them to sound the alarm! He's coming in the flank <laughs> Now let's see what kind of party favors these crowds brought for us. Break open those crates. Those explosives will do nicely. Just remember to save at least one charge for the fuel depot. Let's get back to the car. Just to get the real show started. Ah, most men would have lost their nerve by now. Tell me, my friend, what were you doing in Ireland before you came to my country? I was a mechanic. Not that it's any of your business. A mechanic, eh? Well, the resistance could use a good mechanic. I didn't know there was a resistance in Paris. That's about to change. After tonight, the Nazis will have a new enemy to fear. The depot is just up ahead. We'll need to create a diversion to get past that gate. The Nazis are trained to investigate the sound of gunshots or an explosion. Use that to your advantage. Ten pounds of high explosive on that truck should get their attention. Oi, that'll do. Start by climbing that building. Once you're on the roof, keep your head down and wait until the truck explodes. Then, use that telephone wire to cross the street into the fuel depot. While the soldiers are distracted, move in quickly and place a charge on the primary storage tank. I'll meet you by the gate when it's done. Watch your ass, Irishman. Like that. They're gonna see me. That's my cue. Time to leg it. Here comes the welcome wagon.
up to uh, now cut up now some gas. I think it's when we can do something up in the cars. Ha! We did it! Tonight we changed the course of history, my friend. <laughs> well, all we did is blow up a petrol station. Though I must admit it, that fireball did make a pretty picture. <laughs> you are wrong, Irishman. Something has changed. It is in the air. Can you not feel it? Well, now that you mention it... It is just get some rest, my friend. We will have much to do in the days ahead. Oh, why? If by that you mean a sweet brunette and a glass of whiskey. Enjoy your reward, Irishman. You earned it. I owe you a drink. Actually, like, I'm actually liking this. I'm actually liking it. I thought I, I, I would, but... I am. Can we save it? Is there any way? Ah, there we go. Save it. All right, this is actually a lot of fun. If I don't sell What's got into you, mate? What the hell are you doing? What's it bloody look like? Your roar is my girl now, Sean. I will not have another man picking up her skirt. Eh? Oh, for fuck's sake, Jules. You're a driver now. You want respect on the circuit? You gotta stop thinking like a mechanic. All right. I'm put on airs like some posh wanker with a silver spoon up my arse. No thanks, brother. Veronique! Morning, beautiful. I'm coming along for the race. Vittore asked me to take pictures. Couldn't he wait till I made myself a little more decent? I don't believe in miracles. Oh, my sister got all the charm. And the brains. That's enough screwing around. We've got a race to win. You boys have work to do. Both of you. Say the word, boss. Let's get our girl on the trailer. I want to be across the border by sundown. Ready to move out? The truck is loaded and ready to roll. And the Aurora? Trust up tighter than a nun's arse. Good. Veronique and I will ride ahead. You boys take the truck and head east to the German border. From there, it's a straight shot to Saarbrücken. I've marked the location on your map. So... I don't think... I think... Come on, Sean, get in! Yeah, yeah. My friend, after tomorrow, you'll be a famous driver, and I will be right there beside you reaping the rewards of your success. Which rewards did you have in mind? The women! These German girls are crazy for racers. We'll have a dozen blonde beauties feeding us grapes, huh? <laughs> Assuming you don't fuck it up, of course. <laughs> well, I appreciate the vote of confidence, Jules, but there's more riding on this race than you get in your hall knocked off. 
Vittori took a big gamble making me his real man. You're not gonna let him down, Sean. I hope not. Vittori's got bigger problems to worry about these days. Like what? Like the fact that a war could break out any minute, huh? Don't you read the papers? Just the sports section. These Nazi bastards are itching for a fight. If they get their wish, we're all gonna be out of a job. So, so, so you must find out what happens to the cats uh, after well, this is three months earlier. Like 30s There's the border up ahead. Drive slow and try not to look suspicious. Right. I should have warned me leader, Hosen. I'm serious. These assholes are looking for any excuse to start shooting. Fumes from here. You just keep your eyes on the track and the pedal to the floor, my friend. You let me worry about the rest. <laughs> Are you volunteering to be my manager? What's so funny? I didn't have to be a mechanic, you know. I could have done anything. The teacher used to say to me, Jules. All of these kids are stupid, especially your cousin Javi. But not you, Jules. You are too clever for your own good. I thought Veronique had the brains in the family. She likes to think so. What's her beef with me anyway? I can't put a foot right when she's around. Hey, it's not just you. Veronique is tough on men in general. Why's that? One of these days I'll take you to my family's cabaret in Paris, huh? Veronique was raised in the Belle de Nuit. Let's just say it was uh, not your typical upbringing. Sounds like fun. My friend, you have no idea. I'll meet you at the bar. First round's on me. Whoa. I'm glad you finally decided to join us. We took the scenic route. You run into any trouble? Just the usual groupies, looking for autographs. A toast to Team Morini and Our Lady Aurora. To Signor Morini for taking a big chance on a dodgy bloke like me. <laughs> Another round for me mates. Easy, Sean. You'll need a clear head tomorrow. Dirker flew in this morning from Berlin. Kurt Dirker? I thought he was retired. Speak of the devil. Guten Abend, Herr Morini. Always a pleasure to welcome one of our Italian friends to the Fatherland. I was just speaking of my admiration for General Mussolini. A kindred spirit to our own Führer. Your country is fortunate to have such a leader, yeah? Racing is my passion. I find little time for politics. Sometimes racing is politics. No. There is a difference. You must forgive my ignorance, Herr Morini. We Germans are a simple people. Perhaps you would enlighten us further? One's a hobby for rich assholes who can't get laid without a flashy car and a silly uniform. The other is racing. This must be that British mechanic who thinks he's a driver. 
I'm fucking Irish. It's getting late. Why don't we call it a night? The night is young, Fräulein. Stay. Dine with me. I've no taste for German cuisine. Not yet, perhaps. But soon, the women of your country will learn to savor the taste of a purebred German bratwurst. Bastard! Let's get my crazy sister out of here before she gets herself killed! I'm not going anywhere! Enough! I'm taking her upstairs! And stay the fuck down! I don't think he can hear you. Easy, big! Save some for me! You fucked with the wrong crew! Come on! The barman's talking to the police! I'll take care of Veronique! You boys! Get out of here! Jules, time to get scarce! Right behind you! I think this really shows like the toughness of that part of the time when it was when the war broke out. Bollocks. Watch it, you bloody Fuck me, Skyler? Oh, are you chatting me up? Hello, Sean. Hi, Jules. Nailed. We'll catch up later. Right now we need to borrow your car. So much for awkward small talk. Drive the fucking car! Hold on to your arses. Oh, love it. Just like old times, eh, Skyler? Never a dull moment. How long have you been in town? Mm, just got in, actually. Oh, so you wasted no time running afoul of the local police? Oh, those fellas behind us, they're just having a laugh. Is this Desperado routine meant to be a turn on? I don't know. Is it working? Would you watch the fucking world, please? The radio ahead to set up roadblocks. Double back and you should be able to slip through the net. I teach you that in your partial English school. Ooh, benefits of a higher education. All English girls as crazy as you are. Give us a bit of privacy, would you, Jews? Oh, I'd love to, as soon as you check these crowds. Yes, I'm not going to be the third wheel. Take me back to the hotel. I'm going to bed. Keep the noise down, eh? I need some fucking rest. Come on up. I'll sneak you in the back door. Wouldn't have it any other way. Holy fuck. <sighs> Nothing like a brisk evening drive to quicken the blood. Except perhaps a single malt McGarren, aged 30 years? Must be Christmas. Lucky for Jews and me, you came sliding down the chimney when you did. Christmas, is it? Oh, I'm afraid I've been a bad girl. Aye, I'm certain of it. Whatever happened after that weekend in Monaco? You never rang me up. You never gave me your number? Oh, that's hardly an excuse. You're not still pining for Jules' little sister, are you? She's a bit of a bore, don't you think? I don't think I'm her type. So, you in town for the race? What can I say? I have a weakness for men in fast cars. I've been all over Europe following the circuit. Mum and Dad are mortified, of course. Beats working for a living. I wouldn't know. What's this for? Shaving your legs? A girl should always carry protection. One day you'll have to tell me how you came by these scars. We've done enough talking for one night.
Where's the Duchess of York? Don't know. She was gone when I woke up. To be honest, I feel a bit used. Oh, my heart bleeds for you. Come on, let's get to the track. Jack of vehicle. Up in Joe's. This is your moment, Sean. Remember what I taught you. I trained you to win. Watch your ass out there. These Nazi bastards are out for blood. Drivers to starting positions. <laughs> I'll see you at the victory party. Sean, I forbid it. Did you not see what that bastard did? 
The race was mine, Vittori. Don't go looking for trouble. It finds us all soon enough. It's time we went home. I'll see you to the Aurora. Wait for me at the pit. What's that? That is where the silver dart will be on display after tomorrow's ceremony. What ceremony? In honor of Joker's victory, the latest triumph of the Aryan race. How oh, bollocks. It'd be a damn shame if something were to happen to Joker's car before the big shindig. You mean some kind of freak accident? Oh, that would be terrible. Aye, tragic. Who's up for a little Sunday drive? I'm game. Where are you two going? Vittori told you to wait here. Uh, we won't be long. Jules, don't be a fool. If you want to get yourself killed, I can't stop you. But leave my family out of it. Jules is his own man. If I may chime in... It's not polite to eavesdrop. Didn't they teach you that in boarding school? Quite the opposite, actually. <laughs> Perhaps you were too busy screwing your teachers to notice. <laughs> Please, we can't all die virgins. Brother, let's go, Jules. You're making mistakes, Sean. <laughs> when did you become the voice of prudence? Dirke isn't who you think he is. Oh, he's not a motherless arse-faced knob jockey. He's dangerous, Sean. Let it go. Thanks for the tip. We'll see you girls later. Here comes our boy. Let's find out what he's up to. Don't get too close. We don't want to spook him. Hang back a bit, but don't let him out of your sight. This isn't the first time I've run a tail, you know. You're going to lose him! Move up! Sister drives better than these. Step on it! Looks like he's headed out of town. There's only one place he could be going. The Double Sig Motor Works. That place is going to be crawling with crowds. This scheme of ours could get tricky. I've heard rumors about that place. Some people say they're making more than cars out there. The head of Doppelsieg has powerful friends in Berlin. Aye, Karl Eckhardt. I saw him at the race with that banshee bodyguard of his. Franziska. She's one cold bitch. That's the motor works up ahead. Let's stash the car and take a closer look. There on the left, you don't want him to I see remember us. Go, I remember getting this far, and this is how far I got until so I stopped. Just fancy a little exercise. Maybe then come all the way out here for the view. Pretty rude of us to drop in without an invitation. I'm French, I'm supposed to be rude. Come on, let's get over that wall. Looks like a good place to climb over. Ah! Fuck! You all right? Yeah, get over here. 
How did you learn to climb like that? Creeping out of bedroom windows at three o'clock in the morning. <laughs> There's no way I'm letting you dead, my sister. Nice place. They should have a great view of the lake from up here. There it is. What do you say we take it for a little test drive? Right over that cliff? You can do the honors. I prefer to watch. Looks like I need to work on my parallel parking. Maybe we should leave a note, eh? Dear Wanker, sorry about the bang up. Send the bill to me arse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, give me right harm to see the look on that tosser's face. That can be arranged, Herr Devlin. Shite. Hold on, Jules. Stay with me. Stop! Stop this! For God's sake, stop hurting him! Sir! I'm here, Jules. To God's sake. Jules. Your friend cannot hear you at the moment. I'm afraid the pain was more than he could bear. Francisca tells me you have been eager to see the look on my face. I hope you are not disappointed. What the fuck is going on here? Do you believe I spend every waking minute behind the wheel of a race car? <laughs> I have other, more practical talents with which to serve the Reich. My services are in great demand of late. Why are you doing this? I'm a patriot. You're a fucking animal. We are all animals beneath the skin. My godfather taught me that. He was a butcher, did you know? He taught me that the flesh holds no secrets once the skin has been removed. I had a long talk with your friend. He sang like a bird. But he could not tell me what I most want to know. And what is that? Bishop is not half as clever as he thinks he is. He imagines that we are all blind to his childish schemes. Typical British arrogance. Who the fuck is Bishop? Maybe you should be talking to him. Do not insult my intelligence. We know that you are a British agent. We know that you were sent here to conduct surveillance on this facility. What? You think I'm working for the damn Brits? You must be out of your bloody head. Enough. You will tell me every operational detail of your mission. You will tell me. One way or another. Pull your head out of your arse, man. I've got no idea what you're talking about. Your choice is simple. You may choose to tell me exactly what I want to know, freely and without omission. In which case, you and your friend will return to France to live out the rest of your lives in peace. Sure. Or you may refuse. How are you there? I'm right beside you, Jules. In which case, neither of you will ever leave this room. Make your choice. Now. Go fuck yourself! As a prisoner, the interrogation will continue when I return. You think I'm a spy, do you? Well, that can be arranged. I can become a spy. No worries. Brother. 
Before this is over, they're gonna wish it hard. Totenaufmarsch ist fast beendet. Wir sollten in kurzer gehen erst verrufen. <lacht> Die Deppen würden nicht wissen, was los ist, bis es Ich brauche eine Zigarette. Ja, ich auch. Ich hab keine.
I love the transition between color and black and white. I didn't tell you to get up. Thank God you're unharmed, child. Thanks, Sean. They would have burned me alive. These men were Gestapo. What are they doing here? Dierker sent them. Dierker? Oh my God. Where is my brother? Where is Shul? No! Get away from me! This is your fault! You took him to that place! Shul! We can't stay here. More Germans will come looking for these. Where will we go? West. It's our only chance. Right. To Paris, then. We'll get you home. Let's go. Oh, Sean. Veronique! Oh, my child! Merci Dieu! We heard on the radio. The fighting at the border, we were so worried. I see you brought guests. 
These are Jules' friends, Jean and Vittore. They need a place to stay for a while, someplace discreet. Well, but uh, where is Jules? Did he not come with you? Mama. Uh, something terrible has happened. <sighs> Madame Rousseau. No. No, this can't be happening. Your son. He was like a brother to me. No, 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 mon petit fils! No! Young man, I must know. My son, Didi, was it quick? I. Quick and painless. Bastard the kill him won't be so lucky. I took this from the farm. He would want you to have it. Such a good I never can't believe I've never played this game before. So good. <laughs> I'm going to ha have to finish it there, guys. Thank you very much for watching this first initial video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I'm going to add this to a um, World War playlist. So this won't necessarily be on the blind. It won't be on the blind playlist. I want to have different theme playlists going forward, I think. I've decided I think I'm going to change the direction of the channel slightly. Um, and I'm going to have like PS1 classic playlists and stuff like that. Because putting it in one playlist is just going to be easy to make an all individual playlist. And I've got so many at the moment. So it's a very different theme of the channel going forward. Again guys, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and drop me a comment as well. And I'll see you very soon. Thank you guys for watching the video. You've reached the end. So thank you again. This has been recorded and edited by myself. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. If you want to see more, please hit the subscribe button. And hit the bell to get notified of when I upload. If you want to see me do live streams, head over to my Twitch. Link is in the description. Thank you once again, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.